Okay, good morning everybody. This is Harold with World TV On Demand again coming to you. So today is another day. I got my wire brush set here and I'm going to go ahead and wire brush the back of this and clean it up real good and I'm going to paint it. I got some uh, Valspar uh, stain blocking bonding primer sealer to put on here. It's for metal. And it's for water, and uh, hopefully it's going to be about the same color as the boat here, and paint it up. Fill, it's supposed to fill cracks and stuff. We're going to see what it looks like when I get done with it. But i got to clean all this caulking up where I let it get over on everything. But I wanted to make sure all the holes and around all the screws was good, and that was yesterday. So maybe this thing will look good and be all sealed up when I get done so I'm gonna go ahead and work on that a little bit and uh, you guys can hang in there with me if you want to and we'll just uh, do some sanding and some wire brushing and some painting a little bit so stay with me now let's get this done That's hard to get everything. Well, I gotta get every inch. I can't leave nothing on wire brush. I know you're probably saying why why we're back getting this so good back here, but nobody's gonna see it and the motor's gonna be hanging down. But hey, you might as well make it look good if you can. So I'm gonna finish going over this with the wire brush. Then I'm gonna get me some sanding paper out. I got some sanding paper. And I'm gonna sand the big flat area here and get it down, get all the grub crud off of it. But if you would, subscribe to the channel and give me a thumbs up and comment on the video. And, uh, you know, this back in this thing looked like Swiss cheese before I started. I think it's looking better. And when I get done with it, it's going to look real good. And it's going to be watertight. That's the main thing, watertight. Looking good and watertight. That's what we want on this boat. This is a G-R-U-M-M-A-N, a German Grumman. Grooming. Hey, how do you say that? Grooming or German? I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> I'm going to clean up on this thing a little bit more.
Well, I killed that battery. I'm about to kill my battery in my camera there. Luckily, I got my fancy charger here. And another battery. Let's see if we can't get this finished up here. Now. I think I'm done with that. So now I'm going to wipe it down, clean it up a little bit, do a little more caulking on it. I see a couple of holes and get ready to paint. So I'll be right back with that. But don't forget to subscribe to the channel because I'm going to make a bass boat out of this John boat. So I'll be back in a few minutes. You guys take a break. So where was I? Oh, as I was doing the wire brush, I saw a couple of the holes, so I'm just going to touch them up a little bit with my little fancy caulking here. But while we're doing this, you know, YouTube is starting to censor me a little bit on some stuff. Censor. Oh, censor. And uh, all my Cody stuff and stuff like that, they, you know, they censoring all of that stuff. But Cody's up and working good. Got a lot of add-ons on my webpage at worldtvondemand.com. A lot of source files. A lot of source files. If you go to worldtvondemand.com, a lot of source files. It's going to bring up 600 videos. On how to use Cody. What Cody's all about. Now what I'm going to do is this heavy duty cleanup. Thins fiberglass resin epoxies, adhesives, and dries fast dries real fast. So this is what I'm going to use to wipe this down. I use this. I've been using this stuff for years. Had it around the house here for years. Out in my shed. I may have to, I may have to go in the house and get some pliers to open it. So let me go do that and I'll be right back. Okay, I got my pliers and loosened it up. Well, actually, I've got my my Craftsman channel locks, which are good, good things, man. Craftsman channel locks. I'm just going to put a little bit on the rag. 
I'm going to go around these areas that I just caulked a little bit. With that, with that rag, I'm going to go over it one more time with a, a little bit cleaner rag. Just to go over it real quick. Just to make sure. No grease or oil or anything on it. You know. Okay. So that is looking good. So now I'm going to let you look at it here real good. That is looking so much better. So much better. Yep. Better, better, better. Better, better. There you go. So now let's get a coat of paint on it. Let's get a little bit of paint on it. <clears throat> now you can do what you want to with yours. You know, whatever you feel is right. But this is just, this is a real old boat. Need a little bit of, need a little bit of tender love and care. So, we're going to see what we can do. Let's see how this, look, this, huh. This paint is thick, thick, thick. It's thick like, uh, let's see, what was it thick like? It's thick. It's just thick. And I see why they say it fills holes and, and all that stuff. Got to turn the camera around so I can see. Now this stuff is, looks like it's going to be good. later date. Very soon if I can get some of my friends over to help me, I'm going to take it off the trailer, turn it upside down. And do the bottom. fast. I might put two coats on it before I get done. Looks like it might have a little crack or a little hole in. Just fill up that load up the brush with a lot of paint and just fill it up. Oh, and back on the Cody stuff, if you guys use a Cody box. If you want local channels, if you want live channels, just put up an antenna. Just put up a doggone antenna, man. You don't even have to put one outside. You can put one inside. I didn't put Cody in the description or anything on this video because if you put Cody in the description, they'll flag it. Yeah, this. Yeah, you know, this this country we live in it's supposed to be freedom of speech and everything. You can't even talk about anything without somebody complaining about it. 
Cody is like having a huge DVR with all your favorite stuff on it. I didn't really want to give him any that particular piece right there. And you can, if we miss our shows, which we do a lot, we just watch them on the Cody box. We just watch them on the Cody box. So you guys watching you guys watching bad girls? Or is it good girls? Good girls. You guys watching that show, Good Girls? That thing is crazy. We like it. I'm going to let that simmer just a little bit. My battery's about dead in my camera, so I'm going to change that. And then, uh, by the time I change the battery in my camera and get set up again, get me a little something to drink, it'll be time to hit it again. So I'll be right back. Looking pretty good. Looking pretty good. Well, this is looking pretty good now. It's dry already. So I'm going to put another coat of paint on it just to make sure and see how it goes. And, uh, it's looking pretty good. It's looking pretty good. What do you think? Make a comment down below in the video and let me know what you think. Am I doing okay? Is it looking all right? Let's see other TV shows and movies we like. Yeah, let's go with that. The Mule. Did you watch The Mule? The Mule. That's written by Clint Eastwood and stars Clint Eastwood. It's pretty good. You got. I mean, if you haven't seen it. I would recommend it. It's a good movie if you like that kind of movie. And I was skeptical because I'm not a fan of that type of movie, but it turned out to be pretty good. The Mule. The Mule. <coughs> Okay, that is that. And I got enough of this paint left. And I got enough of this paint left to paint the whole boat three times. I mean, that's a lot of paint. A little cork covers a lot of area when you're painting metal because it don't soak into it like it does wood and stuff. I might paint that piece of pressure treated wood in there with that. I don't know. It's going to mainly be covered anyway. I don't know if I need to do that. But uh, well that's done. It's got to dry a little bit and then it'll be evened out. That'd be pretty good. But don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I don't know where my channel is going to go from here, you know, because they don't want me to do Cody stuff. 
the new stuff. I did real good on the new stuff, and then they started blocking me on some of the new stuff I was doing. And uh, so now I'm, I'm doing, I'm going to be doing the fishing boat stuff and fishing and talking about Cody in the video, but I probably won't be able to put nothing on the video about in the description or any of that so when you see my name pop up I'm going to change it from world news again I'm going to put my picture back up there and just put Harold or whatever you know whatever uh, something but I'm not I'm not going to take down anything that's on the channel but YouTube might take some stuff down and might uh, shut some videos down but you know, it's funny because they let all this pornography and all this, uh, I don't even want to say some of the words, I might even cut this out of the video, but, you know, they let a lot of bad, bad, bad stuff on YouTube, and all we're doing is talking about stuff and trying to save people money on how to use a TV, stuff like that, trying to report local news and stuff. I even took my camera down to a local place where the police was at and filmed a uh, a couple of police cars. There was no blood, no shooting, or nothing like that. Just did a little report on it, and YouTube blocked that video. Uh, just talking about something. I mean, talking about censorship. My God, it's terrible. It's getting terrible in the United States. So anyway, follow along with me on the boat. I'm gonna have another one when I start doing the the bottom and and uh, doing the deck and stuff inside. I want to turn it upside down and do the bottom before I do the deck because once I do the inside of this boat and get all the batteries installed and all that, I don't want to have to be turning it upside down. And I'm going to make sure I check every nook and cranny on the bottom and make sure that there's no leaks. I'm also going to put a pump in there, a sump pump. Probably put a hole right here somewhere for the bilge pump on the side, for the bilge pump to pump out. So. I'm going to try to do a good job. I've never done this before, but it'll be fun. So anyway, this is Harold with WorldTVOnDemand.com and YouTube.com slash Harold Jackson. You know, I, hopefully you'll always be able to find me there no matter what I call the channel or call my, uh, my sub-channel at the time. And check out my, my page, my homepage on YouTube and check out all my videos and you guys have a great day and when I work on the boat again I'll make another video and I'll have another one for you and you guys will see me again soon I hope so thumbs up subscribe and comment and I'll talk to you later it's root beer